For Sanya, photography is both a passion and a profession. She started taking pictures while studying at Sana'a's German school and could not imagine doing anything else. I was taking pictures of the simplest things as a hobby. I loved photography. It's a spirit. I felt that I found my soul in photography. In Yemen's male-dominated culture, being a female photographer challenges traditional conservative values. Sanya's parents support her on condition that she respects morals and religion. In a country that's in the midst of a civil war, her subject matter varies greatly, from pictures of displaced people to social celebrations. Another female photographer, Abir, started taking pictures four years ago and dreams of becoming world-renowned for her work. She says her fiancé is open-minded, but she can get into difficulty while shooting and has even been spat on in the street. As soon as they see you holding a camera and shooting, some say bad things to you. Some ask, why are you shooting here? Go back home. A woman's place is in the home, in the kitchen. Not so long ago, it would have been impossible to see young women in Yemen not wearing a full face veil. So the models, as well as the photographers, are really pushing boundaries. Feminist activist Muna Abdullah says that things are starting to change across the board. Perceptions have changed in society. There's awareness now. We find young women in all fields at all levels. They're politicians, journalists, media workers, photographers and models. They're professors and they're doctors. Women are found at all levels and they have proven their role. The female photographers are just a snapshot of wider changes in society.